and yeah, I mean, what are you going to be mad about uh, when you make a good swing when you're nervous? Um, you know, obviously had a had a weird looking shot, but I had a shot, which is which is cool. Um, I took a 50 degree out and just hooded it as much as I could to get it started as left as I could with some tumble spin because going into that Kakuya uphill, it always sticks. So I tried to land it as low into the hill as I could to get it rolling and hit it really well. I honestly, <laughs> I think I thought it was a little easier than a lot of other people. So maybe that was just kind of a product of the moment. But, um, you know, I hit a really good putt after that, which also settled the nerves from the bad putt I hit on 18 in regulation. So uh, it kind of made me feel back upbeat and, and positive about everything uh, like I was earlier in the round. One A, one B, one C. Um, I don't know if I could ever do anything cooler in golf than this. Uh, just, just for me, for my caddy Joe. Um, we we're raised 25 miles north of here. Um, I mean, Tiger Woods is handing us a trophy. Uh, you know, that's a pretty crazy thought. We grew up idolizing him, idolizing Riviera Country Club, idolizing the golf tournament. Um, to get it done is, is it's, it's almost shocking, um, but it just feels, it feels, it feels like it just can't be topped, just for me. Uh, not a lot. I had a few texts uh, from some buddies. Uh, and then <laughs> I have a group chat with some of my best friends from uh, when I was living in Southern California and Long Beach. And uh, the dude that was the best man at my wedding all week uh, was asking if anybody was going to make a hole in one on 10 this week. And we told him he's an idiot and it's not ever going to happen. And uh, so right before uh, we left the range, I texted him and said, Pete, has anybody made, made a hole in one on 10 yet? <laughs> so. We're just trying to keep it loose, do what I would normally do uh, with some downtime. But yeah, other than talking to my wife, I, I texted a couple people um, and just kind of tried to get on with business. Um, I don't think there's very many parallels, but uh, being able to be raised by a man who teaches is always good um, and helpful, I feel like, for a kid. Um, he knows his strengths when it comes to teaching, and the moment I asked him about the golf swing when I was a kid, he sent me to a, a coach. So I feel like that knowledge is, is important. Um, I don't think there's really any parallels between acting in golf other than me at times trying to act like I'm the best player in the world when uh, that may not be the uh, literal case. Uh, but other than that, um, I just feel like it was just being raised by somebody who uh, you know, can teach and, and can, can understand uh, a child or a kid, young adult's growth into something that they want to be great at.